Escape the room! It's me, Barker Mifflin, master of all danger. One of the most important parts of being a survival expert is knowing how to escape a room. Survival nugget number 27, there's always a way out. You just have to find it. The key to escaping a room is being able to notice all the little details hiding right in front of you. And that's exactly what we're gonna do right now. I'm going to train you to see things you might have missed and before long, you'll be an escape room expert just like me. Let the training begin. Ah, as you can see, we've arrived in a very strange room. It looks like someone has been doing some spy work in here. Okay, here's your first test. Count up the number of lights in the room. Then figure out what letter of the alphabet that number is. You've only got a few seconds. Go! Time's up. If you counted the lights like I did, then you came up with six lights strung across the room. Nice job. And if the letter A is the first letter in the alphabet, then the sixth letter is... F. You've got your first letter in the code that will get us out of this room. Huh, I like where this is going. Moving on. There's something you use to drink hot chocolate out of in this room. Find that object. Once you do that, you'll need to figure out what's in the front of the object. It's a symbol. What's the first letter of the symbol? I'll give you a few seconds to figure it out. Here's hoping you passed this part of the survival readiness test. Did you find the coffee cup sitting on the arm of the chair? I bet you did. And if you did, then you know the symbol on the front of the coffee cup is a tree. We're looking for the first letter in tree, and that's T. Oh, we're rolling now. Almost halfway done solving all the puzzles in this room. Barker Mifflin Survival Nugget number 213. When you have a big challenge, aim for the halfway point. It's all downhill from there. Here's your next task. Count all the drawers in this room, then count all the pieces of paper on the wall in this room. What's the total of those two numbers? I'll give you a clue. It's unlucky. But I don't believe in luck. I believe in being prepared. I'll give you a few extra seconds to figure this one out. Time's up. Turns out there are six drawers and seven pieces of paper. And that's a total of 13. Hey, look, you've made it halfway through. That's real progress, trainee. You're definitely going to escape this room eventually. On to the fourth challenge, and it's the hardest one yet. I'm really going to challenge you this time. Here goes. Figure out how many locker doors are closed. Then multiply that number by the number of cans of tomato sauce in the room. Go! Ooh, that was a little more complicated, but let's see how you did. There are two closed lockers in the room, and hopefully you found the three cans with tomatoes on them. Two multiplied by three is six. Look at all the progress you're making. It's amazing. But we're not done yet. Let's knock out another puzzle right now. And since the last one was pretty hard, this one will be easy. Something is heating up in this room. You need to find the first letter of the thing that's heating up. Go! Did you find what's heating up in the room? It's a teapot. And the first letter in T is T. One more puzzle to go and it's a doozy. Are you ready to escape the room? Let's do this. One letter is hidden somewhere in this room. It's in plain sight, but it's not easy to find. Can you find the hidden letter? Just in case you haven't found it, I'll give you a clue. It's above the chair. And that's
That's time. The letter is hidden right up there, next to the lockers. And the letter is S. We did it! We activated the escape hatch from this room. You're good, real good. You solved six puzzles and unlocked an escape room. That's all the training for you today, but there's so much other great stuff to explore on the Bonkers channel. There's a Bonkers the Animated Show, Snurf Fests and Snurf Searches, riddles and jokes with my good buddies Jenny and Ben, and there's even a Bonkers book. Just search for Bonkers wherever you find your books. And don't forget to subscribe to the Bonkers channel so you don't miss any of the new Bonkers stuff dropping every week. I'm off to my zombie survival class, but come back next time for more puzzle-solving training. Barker Mifflin, signing off. Escape the room! <laughs>